Okay, summer's here. Everybody wants to get out and move around, and this guy can help you do that. This is John Markey from Lake Country Soccer. What a great indoor field you have here. Tell me about the facility, first of all. Uh, we, we have uh, two indoor fit, uh, fields. We have the big indoor field here we're standing on, but then we have a small futsal field in the back, mm -hmm. uh, and then we have 20 outdoor fields. You have a lot of stuff going on around here, and I know soccer has grown in popularity in the years that you've been involved. Absolutely. There's probably somewhere around 4,000, 5,000 players just in Springfield alone. Uh, for youth players, but we have six, seven hundred adult players who play out here as well. That's fantastic. Such good exercise for oh, yeah. sure. Oh, yeah. All right. So now you have something new here at Lake Country. It's called the Rush Soccer Program, correct? Tell me about Rush. Yeah, we are the Southwest Missouri Rush. We're part of an international organization. It's got uh, over 100 soccer clubs involved and over 35,000 players. We brought a couple of the two or three of the, the local clubs that mm -hmm. were here together to really focus on player development. And it's a program nationally that is well known for developing players and getting players to where they want to get with the sport. Talk about the age range here for the Rush program. It starts as early as age three and goes all the way up through age 19. Wow, as early yeah. as three. As early as three, they've got something for everybody, uh, boys and girls alike, and, and really focuses on meeting the needs of each individual child in a team atmosphere, but the, but it's really player development centric. Okay, so if you don't start at three or if you don't do like the school spark programs, you can always get involved. It's fun to learn. It's easy to learn. So anybody who might be interested can give you a call and yeah, absolutely. Or visit our, our new website at swmorush.org, which is southwestmissourirush.org, uh, or come through Lake Country and check us out here, and uh, we'll, get, we'll get them hooked up with the right place. What is it that sets this Rush program apart? You said something about player development. What are the things that you really get into the nitty-gritty with it's the Rush really, program? It's really based on each individual player and what their needs are. It, it's not about winning or losing. Winning and losing happens. Mm -hmm but it's really about getting that player developed and, and finding out the technical aspects of what the, that player needs. A six-year-old player needs something different than a 14-year-old mm -hmm. player. Your daughter started her senior year, so she came in without the basics but wants to play at a high level on, on a nice high school team. Sure. So you got to kind of recognize what her needs are and then how can we utilize those in a team atmosphere? Okay. And so it's that way with all kids. I mean, you gotta figure out where they're at and where they wanna get to. Absolutely, and I understand you have a very vibrant women's program. Who am I gonna talk to about that? We do, we, we've hired one of the best women's uh, soccer coaches in the area, Christy Kanoniak is our, is our uh, girls director of coaching and she is really focused on growing the girls program. The girls program has probably always been a little bit behind the boys program in this area mm -hmm. and we really feel like that's a focus. The girls want to play. There's so many opportunities for them to play in college if they want to yeah. and uh, and so we want to get the best person there. Okay, the girls are catching up. Let's talk to that's Christy. Right. So this is Christy Kanoniak. She is the girls director of coaching. It's great to meet you. <laughs> Thank you. Well, tell me about the women's program here, the girls program here. What's it all about? So yeah, we're getting together. We're putting teams together, coaches together to build a program to help develop and grow girls soccer here in Springfield. And you told me you started at age six? I did. Okay. I, I've been playing a while. <laughs> age six, she started in Dallas, Texas, and you still love it and you still play it. That tells me you had some really good mentoring going on with you. How important is that for the girls program? Using soccer as a platform to build relationships with girls is very important to me. I believe that that's, that's how we can, can build life skills and, and teach them through challenges and competitions. We can teach them how to be leaders mm -hmm. and, and encourage um, others around them. You know, those challenges and those, those skills that the girls develop on the field, that goes with them through life. I mean, those um, building character, integrity, um, whether you win or lose a game, those are the things that create um, those characteristics in young ladies. And if you haven't played since you were three years old or six years old, you're 12, you're 15, it's never too late for women as well. It's never too late, I'll absolutely. Get involved in, in, and learn the game and it's, it's fun. Um, we develop players at any level, any ability, so 
Yes. That's good. It, it truly is never too late. And besides all of that, it's fun, mm -hmm. it's challenging, and it's great exercise mm -hmm. for a lifetime. You can always find someone to play. Right, absolutely. Christy, if someone wants to get involved with Lake Country Soccer, how do they do that? Yes, yeah, so they can um, look up our website at swmorush.org. Okay, very good. They're also on Facebook. Check out Lake Country Soccer this summer. You won't be disappointed.